off in time. Jireen's continuing to, to battle here. Some of their bench players making and plays. And, and that's what I sort of talked about a little bit ago about FGCU. Even though this game is handily theirs, you still want to do the little things. Just that it's nice to be sort of home right across the street. Yeah, the Gulf Coast Showcase known for a fantastic field of women's teams on the weekend. They will normally get six Power 5 teams in or five, or at least five Power 5 teams in that tournament as Vespi scores conference transfer, but he's no stranger to FGCU. He was high school teammates with Zach Scott, who came here and played, transferred a couple years ago. But his high school, Westminster, came here every summer, plays in the FGCU team camp, Johnston is very familiar with FGCU, so him transferring here is a little bit of a surprise because he was one of Stetson's best players, but FGCU is very familiar too, or as the season goes. Yeah, there were some games last season where Austin Ritchie was a reason that the Eagles won a close game. He had some big shots down the stretch of some close wins for the Eagles to get them up over 20 victories last season. And he is back with this year's team. He thought about it again. Johnston can shoot it from way out there as well. Now Cato on the baseline drive. Richie going to tee up a long one. No. Onu taps it to himself and then resets to Johnston. Johnston now on the drive, and he threw it away.